If you start feeling a tingling sensation and the edge of your lip or the corner of your mouth begins to burn, be alert because you're going to get the outbreak of an ugly red sore and a few days later it will break open and crust over. Yes, we are talking about none other than a cold sore. If you have ever had a cold sore, you know the signs and how ugly it gets. So let's get to know what is the cause of getting cold sores, and if is there any way we can get rid of them before they appear. You see, cold sores are caused by a common virus called herpes simplex. Most people get exposed to the virus when they're babies or children. And the truth is sadly, there is no cure for it. Once you've been exposed to it, it's always in your system, even if it doesn't often cause cold sores or other symptoms, but it's going to remain longer than any of your fling partners. It's going to forever stay with you. But hey, don't panic, because you probably do not need a doctor. There are things that you can do at home to soothe the pain and make cold sores look nicer as they heal. One of the most important things to remember about treating a cold sore is, do not wait. Start treating it right away, and you may be able to reduce the time you're going to have to bear with it. When you notice that telltale tingle, go ahead and start doing these home remedies. You can numb that area and pain by applying a cold compress to the sore. However, do not put ice directly on your skin. That could damage it. Take some clean ice from your refrigerator, wrap it in cotton clothes, and then gently dab it in that area for some time. Another home remedy is to apply some 100% pure aloe vera gel. If you have an aloe plant in your home, cut the leaves and take out the pulpy gel in the container. Keep the container in the refrigerator for some time, and then apply that cold gel on that sore. Lab research has proven that the aloe gel can help fight viruses, including herpes simplex. One of the other home remedies is to apply some lemon balm extract to the affected area, the active components, namely rosmarinic acid and phenolic compounds, are believed to interfere with the virus's ability to enter and infect healthy cells. Hence, it helps with cold sores to get better. If you haven't heard about the power of essential oil, well, it's time for you to include the following two in your daily lives. Because it has also been proven that applying tea tree and peppermint oils to cold sores works. These strong oils promote faster healing and are useful in the fight against cold sores. You should dilute the essential oils in a carrier oil before dabbing on your skin and apply as soon as you feel the tingle of a developing cold sore. Now the next remedy is not possible for everyone, but if you can get your hands on medical grade Kanuka honey, which is produced by bees in New Zealand, it is as effective as topical medication as a treatment for cold sores, backed up by the recent study published in BMJ Open. Now here are some common home remedies that have been proven to work for many people. However, the result will vary from person to person. Number one is vitamin C and vitamin E. Both vitamins have been shown to fight cold sores. Studies have shown that vitamin C can inactivate the herpes simplex virus, the virus that causes cold sores. Other research has shown that vitamin E can help heal cold sores. Number two is apple cider vinegar, which is said to be able to fight off bacteria, viruses, and other germs. A lot of people also use it as a treatment but full-strength apple cider vinegar could cause severe skin irritation and is too strong to apply straight to a cold sore. Apply it just once or twice a day after diluting it beforehand. Number three is a surprise element, which is toothpaste. Yes, a dab of toothpaste on a cold sore will help dry out your blister faster. However, toothpaste contains a wide range of other ingredients that may irritate your skin. And there is no scientific evidence to suggest that applying toothpaste fights the herpes simplex virus, HSV1, that causes cold sores. But hey, sometimes not everything can be explained in medical terms. Hence, many have found it useful for treating their cold sores. Now that was all for the outer treatment. But to get rid of anything, you must clean your body both internally and externally. 
So apart from the above mentioned remedies, you must make sure to maintain a healthy lifestyle by eating a balanced diet, getting enough sleep, and managing stress. Try meditation or deep breathing exercises. Also, protect your lips by using lip balm with SPF, especially during sunny days, as sun exposure can trigger outbreaks. And if you are dumb and stupid and share everything with everyone, pals avoid sharing personal items such as utensils, towels, and lip products. Now here is the bonus for you all. The above are all home remedies, and it will take some time to show you the effect. But if you want quick relief, you can try Lysine. It's a supplement and is available as a cream or as a pill, and has been found effective in treating cold sores. Another such supplement is propolis. This is a substance that resembles resin that bees extract from poplar and cone-bearing tree buds. As an ointment, it can be applied to treat cold sores. You can also help a cold sore heal with prescription and over-the-counter treatments, which will help it to go away faster. The antiviral medicines available for treatment include acyclovir, Zovirax, famcyclovir, famvir, and valacyclovir, Valtrex. Most of the time, cold sores go away on their own within a couple of weeks. If your cold sore lingers beyond two weeks, it might be time to check with your healthcare professional. Or if you have severe pain, numerous cold sores, sores near your eyes, and sores that have spread to other parts of your body. Or if you feel like you're constantly dealing with cold sores several times a year or more, that's a red alert for you. Without delaying, you should visit your doctor. Your doctor may prescribe an anesthetic gel to alleviate pain or an antiviral oral medication to speed healing or prevent a recurrence. But if you have eczema or any other skin disease before opting for any supplement or over-the-counter medication, PLS consult your doctor because it might further worsen the situation. On a side note, when you have a cold sore, it can be tempting to touch it or pick at it. Try to resist doing these things, which may delay the healing process. Do not touch an open sore, pop the sore, or pick at the scab as it will leave a scar behind and will further delay the healing process. Avoid aggressively washing and avoid having oral sex, you wild animal. It's best to avoid intimate contact with partners that involves your mouth. Wait until it clears up before you resume sexual activity. Eat acidic food. Food that's high in acid, like citrus fruit and tomatoes, can cause a burning sensation when they come into contact with a cold sore. You might want to avoid them and opt for blander fare for a few days. That was all, but if you have some hidden remedies that have worked for you, well, share it in the comment section. See you in our next video. Take care and adios.